Welcome to HostCow, my name is Jacques and in today's tutorial I'm going to show you how to add code to your Joomla site. Now you'll be asking why do I need to add code to my site? Well there's different scenarios and, and reasons why you want to add code. So when you open up a group or page on Facebook they will provide you with some code that you can include on your site with a button where people can click on that to actually become a fan of a specific group or page or whatever so they will provide you with that code now you'd like to add that code in your site another scenario is let's say hostcow ask us to include their domain name availability lookup tool in our site so we're going to use this as an example so they've sent us their code that we need to include in our website to make this happen okay so let's copy their code and we go to our Joomla page and we're gonna create a new module position so you'll go to extensions module manager and let's say we'd like to include that domain lookup tool over here so that's the top position and we will create a new module position we're gonna say custom HTML we're gonna go next and we say domain lookup and remember it's the top position and we like to assign this feature to all the pages it's fine like that so we can just click apply and now we're going to include the code over here so we'd like the code to go here so you won't go right click and paste it in here that won't work you will have to include it in the HTML so you'll click on HTML and this is the HTML source editor and you paste the code in here you click on update right once you've done that this is a form code so this will this will still work but some codes like script codes won't work here so I'm going to show you how to enable this feature that all scripts can work here so let's apply this for now we can save it and this is the the part that nobody really or not nobody but most people don't know if you click on extensions, you click on plugin manager, you'll go to the YCWIG editor, which is the tiny MCE. You click on the editor, and this is where you need to put on code cleanup on save never. Never clean up my code. So Joomla will automatically clean up script code. So you don't want that, so you put that on never. Code cleanup on start off, start up, you say on off you don't want that to, to be clean and then you leave it like that and you click on save right so you can go back to extensions module manager and we can have a look at our domain lookup and you will see remember that section was blue that blue is gone now okay so we can click on apply and we can go to our front page and press F5 right and there's our domain lookup tool almost like hostcar right we've just included that code there so now we can have a look and see if it works so let's do a domain search for for let's say my name dot sierra or dot com and we click on go it will take us to the hostcar website and it will say jacques.com is already taken right so we can go back and we've just added code to our front page and that's basically how you add code to to your front page in a specific module position you can also include the code within the article so if we look at that scenario we can save this and we can go to content article manager we can have a look at which articles welcome to the front page Joomla community portal let's have a look here 
which one you'd like to edit. Welcome to Joomla. Let's take this one. Uh, Joomla Community Portal. Let's go to Joomla Community Portal. Yes. Joomla Community Portal. And now we're going to include the code over here as well. So let's go in here. We copy our code again. And we just put it on top here. And we give it a break. If you want to give it a space, like in if you want this to move down a little bit and just give it a space, you just type in that forward slash. Sorry, it's just br. It's fine. You can just do it like that. Right, and there it's included in there as well. So let's click on save. Right, and we view our front page by pressing F5 and you will see that we've got our search function within an article as well. So I've showed you how to include scripting within a module position and I've showed you how to include scripting within your article. Well that covers how to add code to your Joomla site. Um, we'll be bringing out more tutorials soon. Watch this space. Thank you for watching. Take care. Have a nice day. Bye.